Hello everyone and welcome to another royal reading and in honor of this quite a traumatic Mercury retrograde for me I am going back into the past I'm going through my list of readings that I've been keeping and I am rummaging around and seeing what stories from the past need to be looked at now during this Mercury retrograde and uh, short readings uh, because really my brain is absolutely frazzled. It's incredibly hot here in South Africa at the moment and I can barely uh, string uh, two words together and at this point and really uh, the brain is not working very well at all. So the story that I'm going to be looking at today is the story about Guy the Beagle and those broken legs, two broken legs that happened just after the engagement was announced between Meghan Markle and Prince Harry, Guy the Beagle was the one that was flown over from Toronto, rescue dog flown from Toronto to the UK because of course Meghan had already ensconced herself um, at Kensington Palace with Prince Harry. And uh, the other one, Bogart, was left behind in Canada with a friend who turned out to be Marcus Anderson. Uh, Bogart, allegedly, let's throw that in. Bogart was, uh, we were told Bogart was too old to fly. Mm. And then it turned out, years later, the truth came out. And the truth was that Bogart really hated Prince Harry. And so in order for Meghan to marry her prince, she had to leave Bogart behind with Marcus Anderson, allegedly. So very interesting. So I'm going to be reading around this. I am using the Tarot of Curious Creatures, of course, because we are in uh, reading on Curious Creatures, Meghan Markle and her rescue dog, Guy. Uh, not to mention her husband, Prince Harry. I want to know how Guy got those two broken legs. Did Harry or Meghan have anything to do with it? Of course, just a tarot reading for entertainment purposes. Uh, how does Megan really feel about dogs? Um, of course, the story goes that she was she met Ellen, the famous Ellen, at the rescue center when she was going to adopt the dogs, and Ellen made her adopt the dogs. Uh, at least one of them, I can't remember whether it was Guy or Bogart or both. A story that um, uh, Ellen herself later denied and said, no, I don't remember that at all. I didn't force you to get those dogs, which was rather funny, uh, rather humiliating for Meghan Markle. If she's capable of feeling humiliation, I don't know. At this point, I doubt it very much after what she did on that Ellen show. I don't think she's capable of feeling humiliation. Narcissistic rage, yes, according to the body language guy anyway. Uh, if looks could kill, Ellen would be in one of those willow uh, coffins, one of those eco coffins. Um, anyway, the underlying energy of this reading, wow, is a chariot car. And the, the story did go, the, the explanation was that it involved a car possibly to do with protection officers and that they ran Guy over or Guy ran in front of the car or behind the car or something. It involved a car. It does look as if it was a car. And uh, so that makes me feel better slightly rather than the idea that somebody might physically have themselves broken those legs or caused those legs to be broken car car was involved chariot very clear tarot says okay here you go you asked there it is someone's on a bicycle interestingly and there are two cats there so pets kind of energy the someone on a bicycle does have where is wearing a uniform I think we have our answer, definitely protection officers involved in this incident with poor Guy. We have seen Guy, he did survive. We have seen sad looking Beagle in lots of hardcore uh, PR uh, pieces since being towed along on a lead, looking woeful in Canada again when they did their Megxit thing. And I think we've seen him, uh, Not maybe we haven't seen him so much in California. We've seen the other dog, the, the Black Lab, but not Guy. But there's the answer. Anyway, heart of the matter, heart of the matter, Queen of Cups. Uh, well, it was very emotional, definitely. Uh, so uh, it was uh, something that uh, did she did feel uh, very much. Um, so that's interesting. 
because I'm going to be finding out how she really feels about dogs. But yes, it was something. Queen of Cups is, of course, the emotional female, the the, the female energy, the female energy that is looks at the past, is easily hurt, sensitive, um, empathetic, all of those things. So it was something that was upsetting, particularly to Meghan Markle. And uh, so there we go. She does have feelings. She did experience um, some um, uh, emotional upset over this incident. Um, so how did, and we, we're kind of, we've already answered it, but we'll ask it again. How did Guy get his two broken legs? This was the underlying energy of the reading. That specifically, how did he get his two broken legs? Seven of Pentacles. Is a, is a hanging around and waiting card, Seven of Pentacles. Always have a pause waiting for something. And uh, people waiting, I think that he might have been hanging around waiting, um, sleeping outside, something like that, and got startled uh, by the car. They didn't see him. They weren't paying attention. Seven of Pentacles, you're looking at things, you're considering things, you're assessing things. You could even be out and about sniffing uh, the, the flower garden or something like that uh, at your new digs, your new home. You've just got off a plane from Toronto and now you've landed in, Ken in Kensington Palace all new, sniffing around and uh, oops. So I don't think anybody really uh, was having a temper tantrum or anything radical like that. There have been rumors and allegations about things like that. But let's just check. Did Harry or Meghan have anything personally to do with this unfortunate incident with poor guy? Uh, did they? Ooh, we get the tower. Don't like that card. Don't like it at all. Sudden outburst, a sudden temper tantrum, a sudden fury. It's a female energy in this particular tower. Normally it's a male and female falling. The male is falling. The female is having the explosion. That's explosive energy, the tower. And I hate to say it, but it does look as if, and I'm going to say allegedly, there was an absolute meltdown ambling around in the garden protection officers she had a meltdown guy was the victim of it she was upset about it she was upset about it but this is out of control behavior it's out of control rage it's out of control drama explosive energy temper tantrum wild energy that's coming off that card a real black cloud there are a sudden so sudden from this calm sort of bucolic scene here from the seven of pentacles and uh, somebody it's so interesting because this driver in the chariot is, is looking he's not even looking at the road he's looking sideways he's looking somewhere else and something happened something happened with her allegedly so hmm took a took a, a sinister turn this reading i was thinking we were going to get away with really it was just an accident but hmm. hidden energy here in this reading how does megan really feel about dogs she was able to leave bogart behind and sail off to her new life how does she really feel about them queen of swords wow that's such a horrible energy oh <gasps> vicious energy queen of swords upright uh, cool, uh, not not a loving energy, not like the Queen of Cups. Uh, cool, detached, distance, uh, but would treat an animal well, do the right thing by an animal, but not be all cuddly and huggy and tender with them. It's in the reverse. Uh, she's vicious with them. She really is. Um, that's the true energy. This is the surface energy, the Queen of Cups of her response had to be tears and oh this is so terrible and I'm so upset my heart is broken poor poor guy the truth of the matter is the card that's lying underneath there in the hidden energy the queen of swords in reverse cold vicious cruel brutal would get rid of them without a second's hesitation and uh, I think treats them really really nastily probably shouts at them probably frightens them probably startles them 
you could see it in the way in the cowed uh, looks that they both had when they were on the lead there in that pap shot when she was walking in the park in Vancouver towing her security behind her as well with the it looked like a plastic doll dangling from that little baby carrier harness thing that she had strapped to herself all wrong oh dear oh dear outcome for poor guy how is guy now and uh the fool the fool too and look there is a dog the face he's in a new life he's in a new life whether literally or figuratively i cannot tell you but the fool, there are two fool cards in this deck, in this Curious Creatures. There is the ordinary fool card, where you start your journey and off you go, all optimistic and bright-eyed and bushy-tailed and a bit silly. And uh, you learn your lessons along the way, your lessons through the major arcana and you reach the end of that cycle. And then you get to fool two in this tarot deck. And fool two is the step up. You've gone around once, you've learnt your lessons and now you start again. But you start again from a place of wisdom and you start from a higher place. Guy is starting over in a higher place. It could be that he's in a higher plane, on a higher plane, wrong preposition, on a higher plane. He could be quite literally on a higher plane, but it could also be that he has started a new life in America. Uh, my gut instinct is the former interpretation of that card. As I say, I don't think we've seen him recently. And uh, if he is on a higher plane, well, I'm quite relieved given this reading and how this reading has turned out. And uh, send all your love to any animals that are in the care of Meghan Markle and children maybe husbands if you can be bothered I don't know rescue chickens included and may they all fly the coop and on that note thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow